All right, so our second destination, Cone Appetit or Comfort Food in the Cone. That's what the place I'm at, or that I just came from. And what I got is I got the lobster cone, which is fresh lobster, dren not drenched, but it's like bathed in like a mayo sauce with a lemon and some paprika, and it got some chives and teal in it. I'm gonna show you a little picture. It looks gorgeous. It looks gorgeous. So you know, you get a little bit of everything. Looks colorful, gorgeous, and I'm gonna take a bite. Got my little trusty fork right here, so let's dig in. Woo! That is some good lobster. It's buttery, it's light. And the lobster is the star of the dish. All the element, all the ingredients that I said after the lobster, it accentuates, it complements the lobster. It, it boosts up the lobster, you know, confidence. It, it gives, it puts the spotlight on the lobster, but at the same time, it harmonizes with everything else. And then it's in a, and it's in a cool cone. And it's a cool, it's in a cool cone. Wow, I'm stuttering my, wow, this is so good, I'm stuttering. I'm on a speech impediment. And I spilled some. Party foul. I'm gonna get another bite. Mm. Mm. Light, buttery, sweet, looks gorgeous. And it is delicious. I am so glad. I'm a, ah, got a little. Here's a little something. Woo, 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 woo. Kind of looks like a shrimp a little bit, doesn't it? Mm. Woo! Rain or shine, the food is still fine, ladies and gentlemen. So, with that being said, I'm gonna get into my third dish. Eat Egypt, eat Egyptian. Got a little bit of a stutter right there. So, if you can bypass that, I appreciate that. If you can, I understand, you know. Gotta maintain that professionalism. That's what I'm trying to do. Oh, we got a little bit of a breeze coming through. Woo! Got a little bit of a little bit of a cool breeze stopping by, you know what I'm saying? So stay tuned for the third stop. All right. Oh, and before I sign off, I just want to say Happy Cinco de Mayo! I hope you folks are enjoying it. You know, I hope you got, hope y'all, if you're of age, you know, get the margaritas and the tequila shots and the tacos. You eat and you drink responsibly. Because I don't want to see, you know, I don't want to see no one get pulled over for DUIs or even worse, get a car wreck, you know what I'm saying, or death. I don't want none of that to happen, so... Happy Cinco de Mayo and stay tuned.